Yeah, hi there. These comments are for Dodge. This is Michael. I am the founder, owner, and the materials writer for all of your lessons at the 7-step system to pass the TOEFL YBT. And congratulations. Uh, you actually have some very strong TOEFL scores right now. So you said um, you've taken the TOEFL YBT back in October. You got 90. And your subtotals are reading 16, listening 22, speaking 24, and writing is 28. So you have very strong speaking and writing skills. You say, I was already accepted in a business college in Utah. However, I was not able to attend because of visa concerns. Then you say, I'm applying for a scholarship in Australia for a master's in occupational safety and environmental health. The sad news is you need an equivalent TOEFL score of 100. Wow. Most people would be happy with 90, but you actually need to get a 100 because you want to go to a, a university in Australia. So uh, what do you recommend in my case? Uh, you're taking the TOEFL on March 16th. Uh, you have a deadline to submit your application on April 30th. Uh, I'm not going to look at the deadlines right now because if you try to do things too quickly, you're not going to get the results you want. But based on your score, you have a 90. You need 10 points. That's it, right? So you are you already landed on my TOEFL IBT Study Guide's webpage. So uh, I recommend, uh, based on your situation, the 60-day uh, TOEFL Study Guide. Now, of course, for you, you want more of an emphasis in the reading and the listening areas because your speaking and writing scores are already pretty good, right? So you want to focus a lot more in the reading and the listening areas. So you want to study more in the vocabulary part of my course and the reading and the listening and, and those areas. So again, uh, I recommend my 60-day TOEFL study guide for you. You'll notice in this particular YouTube video, I'm going to put the link to the 60-day study guide for you so you can click on it and take a look at what my plan is for you. But anyway, congratulations again on having some very high TOEFL scores already. Uh, unfortunately, you need to get 100, and uh, I think you can do it. Probably take you about 60 days if you work pretty hard. It's not going to be easy. So going from 90 to 100 is not easy at all, but you can do it with practice. All right, Dodge? Have a great day.